Do you ever feel that your life is just a blur and you're not seeing things clearly? Well, that could be because of this fast-paced day and age we're living in. Or it could be because your eyesight is the issue. If that's the case, then look no further than an optometrist. They could be the answer to your clouded vision. And today, I'm having a chat with one to discover why this could be an eye-opening career for you. And maybe I'll get my eyes checked at the same time. Optometrists do more than just prescribe glasses and contact lenses. They also diagnose and treat eye diseases and disorders, perform tests and provide patients with exercises which can enhance their eyesight. Optometrists are the ones who provide primary care for your vision. Kate, hi, I'm Rebecca. Hi Rebecca, nice to meet you. You too. Now, I've got some questions on what it's like to be an optometrist. Of course, come through and we'll have a chat. Okay, Rebecca, so what would you like to know? Well, Kate, you work with some really cool looking equipment. As an optometrist, what do you actually do? So, optometrists help people to see. We will assess vision and prescribe glasses and contact lenses and sometimes eye exercises. We're also concerned with the health of your eyes, so we'll examine your eyes and provide advice on eye care and eye health. And what's your job like? What do you get up to in a typical day? We'll have a scheduled book of appointments to see and sometimes we'll get some walk-in patients, um, sometimes there'll be emergencies, things that we need to see straight away like uh, an eye injury or an eye infection. What made you decide that you wanted to be an optometrist? Uh, it's a great job. Um, we get to work with people of all ages from kids uh, right up to seniors and it's really wonderful helping people to see better every day, to see more clearly and more comfortably. Recently qualified optometrists can actually diagnose and prescribe some eye medication now as well so it's quite rewarding and, and quite varied. And what would you say the most difficult part of your job is? Definitely time management and most optometrists will have to work on weekends, which um, is a bit of a pain sometimes. <laughs> what advice would you give to someone if they were looking to be an optometrist? Go and get your eyes tested because you'll have a better understanding of, of what it is that we do every day. Okay, Kate, now it's time to give us the edge. You ready? Okay. <laughs> if you could list from school to now, what steps does somebody need to take to be an optometrist? Uh, study hard, get good marks in high school. Western Australian students will need to move over east to study at university. And the courses are anything from a three and a half year accelerated degree right up to a seven year degree, depending on where you study. And what characteristics are best suited in this job to be successful? Uh, good communication skills are pretty important and you really need to enjoy working with people and helping people and I think being a bit of a perfectionist is good when you're uh, measuring and prescribing glasses. And if you could do one thing differently but still end up where you are today, what would it be? When I was in university we had an opportunity to go to Mexico and do some aid work and um, I'm still a little bit sad not to have gone because I think it would have been a really amazing experience. So travel, travel, travel. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> well thank you so much for having a chat with me today Kate, that's awesome. You're welcome. If you could see yourself being an optometrist, head to the Careers Centre website for investigation, exploration and planning your next step. So Kate, what's the verdict? Perfect. Excellent. Authorised by the Government of Western Australia, Perth, 